Deep in the forest of Albion lay the small town of Oakvale, unchanged by time and untouched by the sword. Here lived a boy and his family, a boy dreaming of greatness, of one day being a hero. Sometimes he imagined himself as a noble knight or a powerful wizard. And other times he dreamt he'd be an evil warrior. But in all his dreams of greatness, he could not possibly imagine the power of the destiny that lay before him. Hi guys, the SK Booking ESC 1992 here, along with my accomplice in crime, Josh H. Hello. Josh H here helped out with this soundtrack. And yeah, she's out playing by the Barrowfield Gate. Remember, <laughs> you haven't given her a birthday present yet. Don't tell me you forgot to get her one. Well, or I'm not basing her this time, son. Side hmm. bands of death. I'll give you a gold piece for each good deed you do around Oakvale. That should be enough to buy her a present. Blacko's got a gold now, tooth as get well. Moving and stay out of trouble. Uh, yeah, it's gonna take. It takes me a little while to get used to the controls because it's been absolutely ages to play with, well, since I've played the game. Yeah. That trainer still seems to be working. I'm just getting used to the controls here. Job. Mind how you go, kid. Getting used yeah. to the controls. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. First things first, let's go ahead and do our first good deed. No. Everyone loves the lag. Screw you, fraps. You stupid little idiot. And here's our first good deed. <laughs> around the pot, you look strong! Yes. Right then. The good dude is punching the ball in <laughs> and knocking them beating the living crap out of and hence the kid will give you the teddy. The bad dude here Thank is you beat the crap, crap out of that little kid good. and he gives Thank you the teddy. You. Then you give the teddy yeah. to the bully who gives you a gold piece. I'll let you look after teddy. Rosie. She'll be safe with well, you. Most of the voice, voice actors in here tell me to go the bad way. Anyway, down this road there's your next good deed, which is right, right here. Oh, oh thank goodness. Listen lad, could you do me a favour? I've got to, you know, answer a call of nature. He's got to go find Stay the prostitute. Stay here and watch this stock for me. There's a good lad. Doc gets off at Paul. Just stand between those two stacks and I'll put a good word in for you when I get back. Right, won't be long. That's what she said. Anyway. My cousin says that the barrels in these warehouses might have stuff in them. Quick, while he's away. Unless you're too sick. Come on. Right, it's a good deed. Stuff. Just stand here until he comes back. The bad deed, just the kid says he's smashed all the barrels in. Although I'm sure if it the kid. Not being good is so boring. <laughs> Wouldn't you prefer to be smashing things? Yeah. Come on! There's still time before oh, he gets back! Oh, you're no fun at all. Save that for later. Fine. Have your stupid good deed then. Again, save that for later. No foreshadow. Oh, here it comes. Remember back into the last time I did this let's play? Thanks, as most of the viewers have already face. seen let your dad before know what a the recording console. You made. Um, he d the timer ran out and he just didn't turn back up. He just didn't turn up. And she appears. I've lost Why? Rosie for stuffing you. She has the magical ability to know what to leave. She's a lovely little furry bear. But with yeah, a the last time that other guy didn't show up, and I had to go and smash all the barrels in for the gold coin. 
And as soon as I came outside, she flew away. Thank you so much. Sadly, on this, through this, we can't go to the list, oh, the no, using list of the fence that the guards give you. But I'm going down the good route for a good for the reason of it makes a certain uh, certain legendary item far easier to get than if you take the bad route. Basically, meaning you can usually get it first try. And there's a whole gathering of people there. The pedophile. Anyway, if we go behind this house, we'll find our next good deed. And it's Tiger Woods. What? Uh, I, I was just, um, I, I've never even met this woman. Who is she? Look, Sonny, keep your mouth shut about this, right? My wife's home with our little, but a man should be entitled to do what he likes, don't you think? Tell you what, if you keep this little him out. I'll give you a gold piece. Take the bribe. Grat him out. Take the bribe. Mm. Just don't tell my wife. I can't have find out is about much more fun, especially in this place, because the rumours do spread quite quickly. Everyone seems to be gossip in this game. Honestly, where's that filthy layabout husband of mine? <laughs> With some woman, I don't doubt. So is that implying that you're not? I run his house, bring up his children, and what do I get in return? Nothing. An annoying voice actor. If you find him, let me know, won't you? You have? Right. I'm gonna turn him into Balverine food. What the hell's a Balverine? Thank you. Young sir, for telling me. No, I'm not quite a sir yet. I'm a doctor. Look at the game and think you just spent the three coins. Such a little angel. Put my hands on that pen. I don't think you can't because the um, pub's closed. Right then. We'll go collect our gold from our dad here. We've just been standing there like well, an absolute. Man. Here's your award for good deeds. Well, I think you may have enough there, son. Have you th yeah, yeah, let's go get that keg of beer. <laughs> Getting drunk! I'm sure our sister would appreciate that. Anyway, I actually realised here that I wonder no, what's happening behind this building. Line. I ought to chop them right off! Don't insult me anymore! My mother was right about you! Well, if you think I'm going to cook and clean for you while you're out having a good time with your stumpy, you've got another thing coming! Who is she anyway? Some tarp a from the pixel. village? <laughs> Younger than me, is she? You filthy swine! I ought to chop them right off! See, before that, before doing this rerun of the Let's Play, I've never actually seen that before. I was finding it funny as ever. I'm a trader. I wander the world. And the world for the, and the award for the most stupid moustache in the world goes to... Some little girl I saw seems to have a sister, and it's her birthday. You can judge how big a pedo pedophile people have themselves the, the moustache. It just so happens that I have a rather nice box of sweets. It's Josie Fritzel! Guaranteed to put a smile on any sister's face for only three yeah, gold right. pieces. And I like how he takes interest in his sister. Young sir, they are yours. Wish your sister a happy birthday you, from me now, sir. won't you? Stock available. Get your miscellaneous... I don't like you. What the blazes do you think you're doing? I'm a town guard! I'm not the sort you want to be hitting! Well, I can get away Unless with it, you so. want to spend a night in the barracks! Now, Ooh, get out of my fun! Why all the violence? I hit one guard and someone thinks I'm a, the world's most violent person. Go to show how bloody newbie off the people here are. The, the show. I've never noticed that before. Well, it saves us going off into Hello, look out, brother. no, not look out point. I hope you haven't forgotten what day it is, like you did last year. 
It's a Tuesday. I'm sorry if I woke you up last night. It was another of those dreams. I was standing in this field when something happened. Dreaming about trading. I can't remember what. Never mind that though. I'm still waiting for my present. You greedy bitch. No. No, you're not having them. My chocolates. Wait, chocolates? I just want a fucking keg of beer. I knew you were going to bring me chocolates. It's just uh, like my dream. We're going to have to give them if you want to progress. Come on. Let's go home. All right. Mother will be back for my party any minute now. You sure it's a pumpkin? Wait. There's something wrong. Oh, you want that gold piece I have now as well as the chocolate? Oh. There's a bandit raid. Bandit raid. You missed the knee. What's really happening? They're here. You've got to hide. The Catholics have arrived. Quick, behind the fence, when no one can see me. <laughs> and hence stable logic. Even if they're staring Go right on. at me. <laughs> yes, no one will see me here. Evil had come to Oakvale. Bandits wielding torches and steel, slaying and burning all in their path. Blood-red flames lit the night as the villagers screamed and begged for mercy, and soon their bodies filled the streets. Then the raiders reached the last house, where the boy and his family lived. It was them they had slaughtered so many to find. The father fought to protect his kin, but he was no warrior, and fell mortally wounded. The bandits ripped the house apart, but could not find the boy. Through torture and threats, his mother and sister remained silent, and their furious attackers took them both. From the nearby woods, the boy watched as all he knew was taken away. His whole life was crushed to ashes. He was alone. track here is one from later in the game and um, currently me and Josh here are actually working on redoing this track so when you hear it later in the game it's been much different. The, basis, the basics of it have been the same but we're doing a better quality mostly because my solo is a bag of trash. So did mine. And we'll probably adding extra solos into it. Well, that's good year. I can't remember, it was a while ago. It was actually intended for this Let's Play, play as well. <laughs> it's a little crybaby, reminding me of Tidus from Final Fantasy X. <laughs> Shocking. Oh, we must the leave. Catholics. It's not safe here. They're all dead. You don't want to join them, do you? Of course I do! Then Check out give me your hand. Would you really trust that? Don't want to know where that hand's been. Oh, and plot teleportation. Because they didn't have vans back in those days. Walking is not good enough. Hmm. I thought you'd you have a stronger stomach about three than feet that. Away. Come on. Yeah, Save your energy, boy. Amazing. We're doing that it's later. It's not me you want to fight. You might not realize it, but I just saved your life. There's nothing really? left for you in Oakvale. And if you'd stayed, you'd be as dead as the rest of them. Come with me. My name is Maze, and I'm the head of the Guild of Heroes. You must have heard of it. You'll find nowhere safer in all of Albion, nor a better place to call your home. And if it's vengeance you want, you'll need the training only we can offer. 
Hans from somewhere. 5999 a month. Here we are. I'll introduce you to the Guildmaster. He'll be your guide from now on. And hence the nightmare begins. Here it comes, there's the There he is, the most annoying character in the history you. of characters. Put him in the dorm upstairs, with the girl. Sounds like prison. You don't look much like hero material to me. But, May knows what he's doing, I suppose. Well, follow me then. Here come this this theme is the I think it's the one off my channel. More than likely is. We did it. We did it. We well, read it twice. The one that's on my channel, which is the upstate version, there was one before. I don't know if right now. We actually replaced it tonight. But still it's close, well, you very close. Your training starts tomorrow. <laughs> Finding yourself sleeping in a place you're not familiar with. With some weird old man. Sounds like a typical Friday night. It's time to wake up. You oh must be Lord. my roommate. I didn't know this was an equal opportunities hmm. guild. Shorter than I expected. See more of that later. My name's Whisper. I've been here for a month. Had the room to myself till now, too. Oh, got another greedy bitch. Right. Why is it all the women in this game being so bloody greedy? Sounded like a bad nightmare. Happens to a lot the first week. Some don't even last that long. Not surprised me, you. You won't either if you don't get moving. The guildmaster is waiting for us in the map room. You don't want to be late on your first day. Follow me. Yeah, I can tell here. This is an, I, this is the version before the one on my channel because hmm. there's more. There was more Looks of a tremor like the on this guitar here. Tired of waiting for you. He's probably at the training ground You're across the river. Up Let's go. Would have been here on time, but no, you're just a lazy little cow, aren't you? I have one gold. I'm loaded. Yeah, before and there was a horrid solo here played by me that was completely out of time, so. Yeah. Not enough faces, not enough palms. Anyway, before we go talk to the girl master, we're going to pick up all these cooking apples. In total we need four. No. <laughs> all for a side quest. No, they're not right. Yeah, they might actually not they might actually want to eat them. And then not kill him. You find It's gone. Right, it's, well. it's time to see if you have any brainer. potential. Get in the ring. Uh, I want you to hit that oh, dummy right. as hard as you can. Just keep going till I tell you to stop. Really should not think of this game with a sexual innuendo. <laughs> not making much of an impact there, are you? Here, try with this. Well, binge black deal. Yeah. Due to equip to. What's the word? Withdraw your weapon. If you want to, to change ah, weapon, if you get when you get multiple, you go into the menu when to all, and go to your like inventory and items. An experience. Not items, weapons. Sorry. These orbs contain the knowledge gained from. And here you can just walk over them. Very but I'm lazy, so I just press left shift, and that will work as well. Now pick it up. And well it comes done, towards man. you. Now then, tomorrow we'll. That's very, very that's good for a later training method. Sounds like there might be something loose in the woods. Well, that's not going to be for a this long is a time good yet. good opportunity to test your spirit. I'll wait for you at the Guildwood's entrance while you deal with the problem. Once you're done, we can talk about starting your training. Did it? Now, now, that's offensive to bald people. There's an apple there. Yeah, there's a lot more than four apples among, around the guild, but you just need four for the side quest. Yeah, I think they're... Oh, I missed my buttons.
If you haven't noticed already, viewers, this is post commentary because the commentary didn't actually record while I was doing it. Because perhaps it's stupid like that. Some overly epic music for such a crappy little battle against well a weak done there. one hit. The Beatles are all dead. You oh can come God. out of the woods now. How the hell can I hear him from all the way outside the woods? He's got no way of even contacting me. You've not even got your guilt seal yet. No. Foreshadowing. Good work, lad. Those Beatles can be a damn nuisance. Sucky yeah. voice. I think you've earned yourself some pocket money for that. Sorry about that. If you want more gold, I'm sure Down the servants stuff. could use your help with something. Maybe. Or you can get an early night. Come and see me when you're... You look tired after killing those beetles. Fine, and it's side quest time. First, firstly, we're going to be giving those apples that we got to a woman down here. To get an actually unique item. Shift, woman. At least you're still in the... Why are you even trying to leave the kitchen? Yes, I have to make an apple pie for the guildmaster at the end of the week. Why will it solve your annoying voice? But I can't find any more red apples. I only need another. If you find enough, can you bring them back here? I'll reward you. Thanks. Thank you so much. Here, have... Who the hell's eaten it already? I demand to know! Ooh, let's go, Robson. Oh, never mind. And we can't get through that door. I, mean, I don't think we can I ever get through so that door. so much, hero. And nothing in there. Anyway, we've got another side quest to adhere to. Which is not too far away. But I think... Firstly, I will see. Yeah, first of all, we've got a cutscene to go attend. Which is just up here. The journey's length is of no consequence. The Oracle must be protected. How can you be so sure? We might need you here. Who knows what battles we might face. The signs are too strong to ignore, and the northern wastes have been too long isolated from the guild. There is much I may learn there. Well, I hope nobody thinks you're running away from a fight, trying to cheat death again. You know how people talk. Talk is of no matter to me. May death close his eyes to your maze. What are you waiting for? Come in. Apparently Maze has eyes on the back of his head. He was a great hero once, back when he had flesh on his bones and blood in his veins. He's just a shell now. What does he know of the choices we have to make? Of what it takes to get things Sounds done? Sounds very, very childish to me. That Maze... We're gonna nick some of your shit. These books will come in handy later for a side quest. No, boy. You're supposed. You can always find out where he is by looking at your. I may have saved your life That's once. That's insulting me. I may have saved your. Hit him in the crotch. Hit him in the crotch. I may have saved your life. Yeah, he's not. What I was trying to do there, viewers, was trying to pull off another cutscene is when you assault someone to a degree I did it in 50 you get seconds. punished no one has basically yeah, sent, well, to guild, and sent to the guild sent to the guild no chance being I'm maze. the fastest guild apprentice by mile you're the most arrogant that's for sure apparently so <laughs> Some more, of course, 
We're Fun discussing fast. whether I'm the fastest. I ran to the demon door and back in 50 seconds. This is possibly right, one of those. It's actually door. quite challenging, no, this is. Because if you cock up too badly, it costs you quite dearly, and you have to get the um, run correct. See here, because these people are getting in my way, I slow down. I slow down to too much of a degree. Anyway, this is the mo this is the most difficult part of it. Getting across these stones and back again without getting caught. Luckily, I managed to do it no problem. First try, no sweat. I lost my bet. Fire her! Fire which kid. Only got like 20 gold for it though. It's nothing compared to what you get later in the game. To say when my favourite weapon in the game costs roughly about 70,000 gil. Gil? I'm not playing Final Fantasy. Gold. You look up. Oh, Your training is about to begin. But you have many hard years no, of got tasks and preparations up, so I'll show beforehand. The guild was now the boy's life. The memory of the Oakvale flames still scorched his mind. But soon he had no thought other than training, and he became stronger and more agile with every passing year. His days were filled with grueling exercises, the nights with study in the library. Finally, he was ready to become a guild apprentice, just as Mays had foreseen. The real training was about to begin. Get out of bed, lazy bones. We were supposed to meet the guildmaster on the other side of the river. Well, you should have brought up that woman. We better get going. Race you there. I like how her age has not changed in the slightest as we've grown older. You notice that quite a lot throughout the game, has her, her age doesn't change and you unlock 60. And I actually missed a cutscene here, viewers, I'm sorry. Um, a cutscene with Briar Rose, I think I walked past it at that point. She's just basically taking the piss out of you, saying that you're useless and whatnot. Anyway, off to more storyline. Late again. You do seem to have a problem getting up, lad. You can put that old stick away. We'll begin the training with real weapons now. Get used to the weight of this sword. And let's see if you can hit Whisper with it. <laughs> Come on then. Let's see what you've got, farm boy. Now pay attention. What I'm about to teach you could well save your life one day. The life of a hero is a dangerous one, and you must learn to block your enemy's attacks if you expect to live long. Whisper will try to hit you, but you can block you hardly ever block in this game. Not all blows can be blocked, but you should be able to whisper can throw at you. Enemies don't get a chance to attack, attack anyway. And defense. Oh my god, what the fuck is that? Ah, hello, Thunder. Come to check on your sister's progress, have you? You could say that. Whisper told me you've got a training with some fan boy. Maze thinks the boy has great potential. It's hard me. to keep up with my Whisper. Ha! <laughs> well, why don't we see? Whisper and the boy are just working on their melee skills now. All right, children. Let's see who has learned the most in their training. This will be a no-holds-barred duel, just like your final melee test. Prepare yourselves. Oh, 
Which was where my then sword is going to blow. Range to continue you hit the right mouse key, and when you flourish, it means the the attack can't be blocked. Yeah, that becomes Are insane ready? later on when you're hitting thousand plus. Let's continue training with the bow. To begin with. See if you can uh, hit the three. There's two types of ranged weapons in this game: bow and a crossbow. Personally, I'm not, I don't like crossbows because they're far too slow. They may deal more damage, but, but I really sure don't like them because I can deal more damage over time with a bow. What about the shotgun? Fuck, don't about that. Don't listen to him. Well done! You hit yeah. all the targets. After that, um, Unfortunately, after this, I'm going back to the still. melee thing. So let's see because how you fare against there is a um, event you can do you which can get you a better score weapon. As many for now, as you can. Which is the front target helpful, is for one point. Because the, the iron sword is, is absolutely three, terrible. And the one at the back will score you nine points. And remember, and what he's just said is lies because you can get a maximum of three points from the first one. More 9 points from the second point. one, and 27 from the back one, if you, use, if you hit the and targets at full power. Man. Let's see what you can do. Come on, lad. Get your bow out. And yes, it's E to draw your bow. And here, for some reason, it wasn't going into lock-on. Well, I wasn't going to zoom, but it's not to do it like this. Use the zoom for greater accuracy. That's a good one. Try putting the string back further for more power. Luckily, it doesn't have any knees. Oh, Doing too much damage it was. The guild master is here. Anyway, this Very mini good. this mini game is really, really easy. There's a much more difficult version coming up. Well, it's probably about I'd say about third way through the game. Nice aiming. See, I wasn't even aiming there. I was not even trying. I mean, Next, we don't want to do this again. Learn about the ways of the will. Speak to me when you're ready to continue with your training. I'll be heading to the island by the waterfall. Anyway, before we go there, we want to talk Any to this guy here, want to so we can redo the melee tests. Right. This and melee combat in. against Whisper counts. Right. Let's get Whisper and you in the ring. Same rules as before. I have a special prize for you, if you manage an A+. Right, then. To get an A+, we need to be able to see all that stuff. How did that happen? I got hit twice. That was very impressive. So I got an A plus. Whisper should be ashamed. A plus. That if great means an A plus, I can award get you weapon. An iron katana, which is just a little bit better than a you um, really showed whisper. Iron sword. Anyway, normally I'd go and do the archery training here, but here now I'll just show you how to change weapons. So we go to F and C. The Iron Katana is two points better than the um, Iron Sword. And to go back quickly, just hit the right mouth button. There's also another outfit I want to wear, which is the Hooded Apprentice outfit. I just think it looks better. And this, ex this one only appears in the Fable of the Lost Chapters version. In the original Fable game on Xbox, it doesn't appear. 
and here we have a silver key chest. There are two types of chests in the game. There's silver, there's normal chest and these. But to get these, you need to have the required amount of silver keys. This one, for example, needs 20 silver keys to open. As spoilers, so turn your sound off. You don't want to hear them now. This chest contains the Murin Great Hammer, which is the best Great Hammer in the game. And yeah, on to the next part. Let's get a cooking up. <laughs> yes, that is the end of the storyline now. Yep. It's time to okay. learn about willpower. Talk to the most annoying person in my life. These strong dumbbells look like me. Alright, let's see what you've got. Oh, just a few. <laughs> well, anyway. Use left shift and the um, That's it. left arm. See how many you've been hit in half To cast lightning later in the game when you get more spells. You can customize it, and I'll generally prefer to have the number keys. There's hot keys for spells, because I have a lot of spells active. The technique you need to lock on. Move the camera around. Just move the camera around, and it will just go through more. So here, we have And now hit the gun. Of magic. Well done. Very good, lad. You have learned the free hero discipline. Let's we can now move on to your final test if you're ready. Or you can spend some more time exploring the guild. I believe Whisper is about to go into the guild woods if you wish to join her. So we'll go and play with this be first, because that's what all the good, good heroes do. What's that dot that's moving in the distance? You really showed Whisper. Yeah. Here's the guy you can talk to Any for the archery grading, as he says. The reward for passing it, as with an A+, plus, is a U crossbow. And as I said, I'm not a fan of crossbows, so I'm not going to bother with it. And money's not exactly an object in this game, as I'll show you later. Just let me get to the will area. No, because we're impatient. I like how it stands back and all. You've yeah, got 30 yeah. seconds this. once you first cast lightning. There's a special prize for eight. I can't remember the score to get an eight plus, but if you do it like I do it here, see the first one spawns just attack and move the camera around, you'll do it easy. To get an A plus, I think you need to get over. 9,000! Yeah, he needs to get over 9,000! No, it's something like over 20, I think, for an A plus. Actually, easy. That's astonishing! Bloody hell, A plus! You can tell it's mainly with bloody hell. 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 Yeah, you get a world potion and a resurrection I fail. I still haven't seen anyone perform better than I call, I call them resurrection fails because the almost useless in this game is... Well, if you know what you're doing... You need to use them, then you are a fail. Yeah. If if you know what you're doing, you don't die very often. It's not easy to die. The, the only enemies in this game that are relatively threatening oh, are Hobbs when okay. it's early on, I and need Ice Trolls to the towards the end of the game. The guild. And that's Disgusting about it. Tro well, then again, all Trolls are annoying. Anyway... Those this guy wants us to kill all these are making sparrows, sparrows the guild. around Just the guild. Just look at them. I'll pay you five gold for every one you kill. Tracking Just come and see every time you kill them. It's rather proper, this guy is. And these two on the roof here are an absolute bitch to get. But we've managed to get one over there anyway. What were the chances? Well, if you want to get these two, you 
is do what I'll do in a second. Not this. Let's go and get him this way. But you need to back up on the bridge. Get me. Easy as that. So that's the KFC. Kill it's chicken at KFC. It's, it's not chicken at KFC. It's just a bit. Both unlikely. actually kill this one without even thinking about it because I hit it with the lightning. You see the experience or just around the corner. It's not moving. Yeah. yeah. These gravestones will be of importance a lot later on in the game. A lot later Killed on. The black is good. More of them, but there's still more out there. And now to spend about five hours finding the last one. Is that about a dog? No, it does not. But you'll have to excuse me here while I go and actually find it. But I'm just can't be bothered to cut. Archery grading! Any apprentices for archery grading? find this one sparrow. So it really will have to excuse me with this. But as I said, I just cannot be bothered to put it. You really showed whisper. Aren't you can you shut up here take you Any about two hours to find it. Grading? But no. It's just up on that route. Just see in a second. And that's all of them. Easy as that. Have you killed Ah, oh, you've got another. I think that's the last one. Here's a little bonus. And for all that, we get about 50 gold. Sure, it's a his little bonus. It is the Heroes Guild, after all, so... Archery grading! Any apprentices for archery grading? Anyway, off into the Guildwoods to go talk to everyone's friendly black person. Charles. No, just kidding. The you don't even know who he is. is. Just at the top of the Whisper. Wait. Did you hear that? It's coming well, from get over you there. back for Calibar Village. Bandits. If only we could get across that stream. I know. Why don't you use your bow? Or some of that lightning the Guildmaster it's taught you? I'll heal you if you get hurt. She's actually useless. I think useful for us. Hit left, right. Yeah, right. Anyway, a good demonstration is I finally managed to get you. And these 
guys are dead easy to kill. You even hit a good amount. I have a preference for the bow most of the game. Mostly because it deals a lot more damage and you I'm pretty it. damn quick with it. And did I'm not a big fan of close quarters combat. Wait till the guildmaster hears about this. I don't actually know if you get a prize for doing this at all, but if you do, can you please let me know in the comments? But, meh, I don't really care either way. Money and experience are nothing in this game. You can. Later on, you can grind them up far too quickly. Archery grading! Any apprentices for archery grading? No. Right. And this is where Brian Rose will be, would be, if you went to her the correct point, but I missed her. At least I think I did anyway. She might actually pop up after you receive your guild seal. If she does, I'll take I'll take care of that at the appropriate time. No. Talk to Beardy Baldy over here. The boy mastered the skills quickly, but there was always more to learn. For years, the guild was his home, his school, and his life. But as time passed, his thoughts returned always to the world outside. The life he had lost, the family that had been torn from him. At last, only the final day of tests remained. Success would mark the end of his training. He would receive the guild seal and be free to forge his own destiny. He would become a hero. Before you graduate, there is one final test you must complete. Enter the guild woods and go to the log at the top of the hill. The test will be revealed to you there. Good luck. Hmm, I wonder what it is. Some form of super boss? Some challenging puzzle. Soon find out. Oh, it's just sort of randomly complot How you pass the final test then? It's simple. You must defeat me. Yeah, using all you've learned in your years of training. Yeah, we and get we'll to begin kill with your Hit me if you can. <laughs> Because it just wastes time. Shoot me with your bow. Uh, don't get too close. And that's what she said. And you'll be fine. Excellent. And finally, cast lightning at me. And there we go. That's enough. End of the game. Yes. Quite impressive. Final boss is defeated. Thanks for listening. You will find real battles rather more fatal than this. But you have passed your final test. And you're ready to receive your guild seal from the guild master. Ooh, that sounds interesting. first night you came to us and look at you now maze's faith in you was well look placed. how bad the lip sync is in this come game. along the graduation ceremony will take place in the chamber of fate the oldest part of the guild let the apprentices approach. I know right 
For many years now, you have worked hard to earn so, yourselves the title of... He, this really does give the guild of good name, the fact that only two apprentices call it... ...and you <laughs> out into the world to do graduated. great deeds. Deeds that will bring you the gratitude of thousands. Or strike fear into their hearts. Ooh. These are dark times. The shadows of Albion are stirring, and strange winds are blowing. Your choices, whether they lead you down the path of good or evil, will change the face of the world. Now, take your guild seal and enter for as heroes. Or villains. Remember, this guild is equal opportunities. It's time for you to leave us land. <laughs> but you're still very much part of the guild. On the map table, you will find details of any quests the people of Albion Wait, what? So heroes to so get paid, I have to come and back here? And you'll need to return often to focus Fuck. all your experience into yeah. new skills. Only by doing this regularly will you advance as a hero. Step into the light, and I'll show you how to do this. First, you must select the area you wish to advance in. Strength, skill, or will. Notice your experience pools in the lower left portion of the screen. You acquire general experience by collecting experience orb. And you automatically acquire strength, skill, and will experience by using your abilities in those areas. Ah, you've chosen strength. You could be a great warrior. You can use your experience from melee combat to improve your physique, health, or toughness. Choose one now. Physique allows you to do more damage in melee combat and to carry heavier weapons. Health generally increases your health, how many hits you can take, and toughness increases your resilience ah, to hits. You've chosen skill. You could be an expert archer or a stealthy rogue. You can use your experience from ranged combat to improve your speed, accuracy, or guile. Choose one now. And speed basically increases how fast you hit. Accuracy increases damage done by a bow and also how badly the rescue shakes. And finally, if the castle will move. And then there's Guile, which is possibly my favourite skill in the game. It increases how well you can sneak and general stealthness, but the big thing is it increases your barter abilities, which is key later on for trying, well, for making an infinite amount of money. And gradually throughout the game I'll be going towards ah, that. You've chosen Will. You could be a powerful magic user. You can use your experience from magic combat to learn new spells and improve those you already possess. Choose one of the branches of magic. And magic power just increases your will. So how, how many spells you can use. Now choose the spell you wish to learn. And, and flame is my favourite spell in the game. It has a glitch to it which if you cast it as you're about to take damage, all damage you take is negated and it damages your opponent. Fireball has another glitch as well. Um, later on there's a demon door which requires you to shoot an arrow at it. However, a fully charged fireball will do the same and open it. Battle charge, just you charge in any enemies in your path to take damage. Multi strike, I don't actually know what it does because I've never used it before. I was, lightning, you've already seen. Divine Fury and Infernal Wrath create an AoE effect, aerial effect around you. And it freezes any enemy in spot and deals da and deals mediocre damage to them, or very high damage when you get high level. Surround abilities. Force push. Josh seems to use this one a lot because <laughs> just pushes the enemy out of the way, and there's some funny stuff I'll do with it. Anyway, turn coat. I don't know what that does because I've never yeah, used it. What's that on your side? Ah. Slow time slows down time for a short period of time. Drain life is just a drain spell, deals the damage, heals you. Summon summons the last enemy that you've defeated for a period of time. High level, the longer you go. Physical shield 
while it's up, you don't get staggered and damage decreases your magicka instead of your health. Incredibly useful. Berserk increases how big you are and increases physical and ranged combat damage. Assassin Rush just makes you, as the animation shows, rush around. Heal life decreases magicka to heal health. Ghost Sword is quite nice actually, it summons a higher level, summons more swords to attack your opponents. And Multi Arrow is possibly the worst spell in the game because all it does is just make you find multiple arrows. And they deal less damage. There is little else for me to teach you, but I will always be around to offer you guidance. And your guild seal will allow me to communicate oh, with you no. time. And here comes the nightmare. You will notice it crashing when you have enough experience to spend. I have given you a basic pack of supplies. It'll be enough for a while. Now there's a whole world for you to explore. Woohoo! Anyway, this is what we get, and that's all I have time for in this episode of Let's Play Fable. How much will we be to explore? How much experience will we get? Will Whisper ever shut up? Check the guild for more quests. Probably not. Well, see you next time.